hi all welcome back to the channel so today in this video I am going to explain you one more way to perform drag and drop operation so previously I have created one video on drag and drop in which I have explained two approaches uh, to perform drag and drop operation but in this video I am going to explain the third approach uh, that also can be used if required so basically what we are going to do is we are just dragging A into B and you can see uh, now B uh, the first one this so this is source let's say the, the first one is source and the last and the second one is destination so what we did we just drag A to the destination part right so now in the destination the value is A and the source value becomes B okay so this operation we have performed using this two approaches so that is one is like uh, you have drag to method another is like a drag and drop method so that we have already learned about it and I will give the link of this video in the description or maybe we can click on the i icon on the top right corner uh, so you will be able to see it okay so now let's say I do, I, I do not I am not able to use this uh, method okay so if I do not have this method for example let's forget about these two methods now simply you have to follow how you do manually do it so manually what you do you first hover your cursor into this B let me refresh it first uh, just to make it default one so that is default this is A and this is B so the first you will be moving your cursor to A that means you are hovering over your cursor to A right now what you will do you will give you you will just press your left mouse button right so you just press the left mouse button and just simply drag it drag means you just moving your cursor uh, while pressing your left key right and once it comes here you just release this that means you just you, you just releasing this button right so that simple thing you are doing so let's perform the same thing using playwright and python okay okay let's let me create uh, one more uh, just copy of this one and let me name it a third approach save it and now uh, I do not I will need this two locator uh, yeah I need this to locator but I do not need this one and I am asserting these two thing that is fine this assertion would be there now first we are hovering over it right so SRC hover once you hover over it then what we are doing we are doing a click operation page dot mouse dot click right no we are doing page dot mouse dot down you have to click on the down button and now if you see this down button so what you're doing dispatch a, dispatch a mouse down event what is mouse down event mouse down event is just pressing your left key okay now uh, let's say there is some options are given like click count and button so which button you want to click so it's saying like default to left that means if you do not provide anything then it would by default it would be the left key I mean left button and if you want to click on the right button of your mouse then you have to specifically mention it button equals to right so how do you do that uh, basically you just have to use this thing button equals to um, uh, right that's it but uh, by default it is left so I'm removing it okay so page dot mouse dot down and now what we are doing we are again uh, just uh, you just now hover over this a a, a look at right so now you are doing uh, destination d e s t dest dot hover see you are not releasing your mouse you are pressing already okay now while pressing you are just hovering over to this one so that means you are just dragging it simply right so that's what we are doing here 
while pressing the mouse down we are just hovering over to the destination that means we are just uh, dragging it to A but still we have not dropped it right now how, how do you drop it for that we can write mouse dot uh, page dot mouse dot um, up there should be up yeah that's it so we are utilizing this mouse um, class or I mean I think page uh, from page we are accessing mouse and you can see this is a property in Python and uh, using that we are accessing this down method okay yep. and here we are accessing the up method so I, I don't, I'm not sure if I have covered uh, mouse page dot mouse related uh, methods uh, in a separate video uh, but if required I can create one separate video of uh, mouse accents or mouse whatever things we can do with this mouse uh, I can create one video on that okay now let's run this and let's see if it is working as expected or not so I can run right by test minus s test as headed and uh, now uh, we are in the basics I think yeah basics and it is, it is test drag and drop double clone so we just want to execute this third method or third test method so I'm giving double clone and the method name oh see it should be I mean it will be very quick so we will not be able to see it so I wanted to give a slow motion see the test pass that means our operation is working correctly I mean whatever we are trying to do it is working fine because this uh, assertion these two assertions are passing so let, let's see what is happening exactly so let's give a slow motion of 3000 milliseconds carefully observe you, you will be able to see it. it it will drag from A to B C and it's done and the test passed so uh, we have seen three ways to perform drag and drop operation so whatever uh, would be required or uh, I mean whatever you feel fine or uh, if you find whatever methods you feel or uh, mean whatever approaches you will feel uh, helpful that you can use it in your project or wherever you are using so that's it for today's videos and um, please like share and subscribe thank you for watching